Welcome back to Guess That Letter. I'm your host, Mark Wahlberg, and uh, we have two great contestants here. Cody Ko and uh, Noel Miller are here. Uh, if you are just joining us, uh, they have horribly lost all four rounds leading up to this. Um, they missed the missing K in Cody Ko, uh, the missing W in WTF, no. and also missed the missing S in WOW. You guys suck at this game. Uh, but let's soldier on, shall we? Yeah. Yeah. You feeling pretty good? Oh, yeah. Yeah, I'm feeling confident. Yeah, enough with the riffraff, Mark. Mm -hmm. Let's go. Oh, okay. Why don't we spin the wheel and see how much money you're playing for? Go. You got it. A little, a little English on it. Yeah, let's go. Okay. A little English, you said? Mm -hmm. All right. One, two, three. Oh, jolly good. Mate. All right. Okay. Well. Okay. 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 If you can guess the letter, um, which you haven't done so far, you'll win $10 million. Wow. $10 million. $10 million. Yeah, which is. We would have got $250 million on the last one if we yeah. got that right. Mm. Right. Just one letter. Yeah. That's it. One letter, 10 mil. How hard could it be? Let's, Let's do, do it. it. That's what I thought when I showed up today. Let's play, shall we? Mm -hmm. Here is your missing letter. Let's take a look. That's. And this whole word is written out except for this one letter for $10 million of this phrase right here. That's vowel. I think it's like a vowel. Yeah. What's after T? U. Yeah. 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 U. Yeah. 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 I think it's a U. That's crunch. Crunch. Yeah. So you're gonna go with that's crunch. Mm -hmm. Yeah. So it sounds right. It has a nice ring to it. Yeah. Does, it does have a nice ring to it, with the exception that it's not actually a word. Oh. So it's like it's like wordle. Try a different vowel. Yeah. Okay. Right. Let's try again. Yeah. Let's. Yeah. I mean, let's go with O. Let's. I think it's probably an O. Yeah. Wait. No. What? It's a trick question. It's probably a number. Oh. <laughs> Mark. Uh, I think we're gonna switch it up. We're gonna go with the number six. <laughs> so it's not a password. It's just a word. And, and let's remember all of the things that could help you. Like the name of the show is, uh, guess that letter. Uh, oh, right. you're right. Maybe it's an emoji. emoji. Yeah. The boat. The boat. Mm -hmm. um, let's see if the boat is right. Oh. Yeah, no, so that's not it. Yeah, well. sorry. Um, I think you should get this. I think if you pay attention, I think you may find a clue somewhere. That's what I think. Well, I yes. think that I don't know what it is. Yeah, and I am getting pretty frustrated. So I think that we are gonna guess E. Final. Mm -hmm. Final answer. That's your final answer. Mm -hmm. Okay. Show me an E. Yeah, so it's not E. Oh. Um, and I well, can't let the show end next. like this because that would just be so cringe. Wait. We never guessed A. A. It's a fucking A. That's cringe. 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 Yeah. That's cringe. yeah, we got it. Woo. Right? Yeah, you guys are so fucking dumb. Oh, that's all the time we have. What's up, guys? This is the TMT Podcast. This is today's free episode. If you want this episode ad-free and an extra bonus episode, you can find that right now on our website. Holy fuck, Jamie! Can we get a clip of that deer hit? Get hit by that car? Let's live the flying stoppers may soon be solved. Stop. You're not a stoner. Goodbye. The Army Air Forces has announced that a flying disc has been found and is now in the possession of the Army. Oh, okay. <laughs> I'm gay as fuck. The so-called flying stuff. Look at all these fucking chickens. Malone Brown, you hear this whole? No. Malone Brown dick in your mouth? <laughs> Please look at all the signs, fashion your seatbelt, and get ready for the base. 
That's cringe. That's cringe. That's cringe. That's cringe. That's I knew cringe. it was. I know. I know. I just. We were so close. We didn't guess it at first and then. Well, yeah. I want to thank Mark L. Wahlberg on behalf of both of us. Uh, big shout out to Mark. You know, we've. Uh, oh, nice. Oh, what the fuck? Where did that come from? This is a Where little, did that come from? This is gravity. Gets fucked up in here sometimes. <laughs> uh Big thanks to uh, Mark Wahlberg for coming out and, and hosting. Find always that a blessing. For us. Yeah, always a blessing to see that man. Yeah, I mean, a true um, hero. Mm -hmm. I would say no, he really is like the best dude ever. Yeah, and uh, he wanted to come on to promote the show, and we were like, "Do you want to do a sketch instead?" And he was like, "Yeah, fuck it," because he's just cool as hell. Yeah. So um, we're gonna promote the show instead. Make sure you watch Temptation Island, which airs Wednesdays at 10 p.m. Eastern on USA Network. Yeah. 10 p.m. Eastern and Pacific. And uh, yeah. yes, everyone knows I'm a, I'm a big fan of Temptation Island. So I'm actually going to watch it. It's uh, Fuck the fucking ultimatum Netflix one. Fuck the ultimatum. Dude. Yeah. Oh, I stole that idea. Oh, I've I went in on them. Oh, yeah. I didn't I, I didn't watch your video, but in. I saw you did a video. I went in. Did you really? Yeah. Did you call them out for stealing it from Temptation Island? No, I just I just wrote like, uh, I don't know, like 15 minutes worth of just like shit. And all them. <laughs> And did you watch the whole thing? I did. I'll say this, I because I did say in my video that <clears throat> the the format is genius, but not for the reasons they intended. And I and I said that everyone who wanted to like get on like a moral high horse about like oh this is terrible, it's like shut up because we sacrifice young couples every day for reality TV. That's just what we do. Right. So, That's America, baby. Yeah. So there's no morality discussion to be had. Right. Um. But no, I didn't really go in on the fact that they stole it, but uh, they definitely took it. Yeah. Yeah. Fuck the ultimatum. All my homies hate the ultimatum. Yeah. Um, fuck the ultimatum, but Netflix, you know, I'm, I, I, we're still open to doing your comedy festival next year, so don't take it as a, you know, as a shot at you. you know? Yeah. Yeah, and, and we're still buying your stock. <laughs> nobody else is everyone else is selling it but we're yeah. <laughs> i'm trying to buy it because yeah. i i really believe in you guys yeah and i think the fact that your stock is down 70 percent over the year doesn't mean shit yeah as soon as squid games 2 comes out it's over. gonna pop yeah it's over it's over for these so i'm buying i'm buying big right now and that's not financial advice <clears throat> that is not it's Financial, um, fuck. Hold on. What is the word? What is the Hold word? On. No, no, no. Shut, shut up. Brain fuck. Hold on. Hold on. Hold on. I got it. Um, um, I got brain uh, fuck. Anthology. Um, canoe. Um, is that helping? Six, seven, nine, four. That is financial law. You have to do you it. You have to. You do have it. to take Cody's yes. advice. Yes. It's not the word I was looking for. <laughs> Damn it. That's a financial requirement. Yeah. There you go. We're listening to the show. Buy Netflix stock. Our lawyers are freaking the fuck out. <laughs> Hold up. What the fuck are they yeah. saying? Yeah. You guys are required to make all the same financial choices we have made. Yeah. Yeah. So invest in a go-kart and invest everything into Netflix. Kidding. Satire. This is not financial advice. No, you know, you know what you should invest in, though, is TMGstudios.tv. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> a little segue. Because uh, it's, it's killing it. People are really liking it. Yeah, it is. I actually... The launch last week could not have gone better. So yeah, yeah. we just want to say a genuine thank you to everyone who Big. has signed up and who's like using the platform, commenting. It's alive in there. Mm -hmm. it's sick. We're in there replying to comments. People seem to really, really like the experience. A ton of people have uh, signed up. It's it's really sick. And we've been we've been working on this for over a year. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I realized that yesterday. Yeah, like it's been a it's been a long time coming that yep. we've been looking forward to launching this website. So to launch it. And to see everyone in there, like, signing up and everything is fucking awesome. Um, <clears throat> by the way, we're just going to brush on this real quickly. We're not going to promote this too much. But there is an app. There is an app, We launched yeah. an app as well. It's an app and a website. Uh, the app is super slick. The experience is fucking, it's, dare I say, frictionless? Mm. <laughs> it's called TMG Studios. So look for that in the app store. Yeah. Um, so but yeah. if you're going to sign up, if you're going to pay, do it on the web. Because Apple takes that 30% cut, so we have to jack the prices yeah. on the app. You can sign up on the app. It's just more expensive. So sign up on the thing. And you get a free month. Don't mm -hmm. forget that. Free month? If you sign up right now. So. <laughs> someone, 
someone like I was like, dude. First 10 minutes of the last episode is just a big ad. It's like, we've been working on this for so fucking long. I know, dude. It's not really an ad. Like, we we worked on something to offer a better experience. It's not, it's an ad, but it's not like, I don't know. If you don't want ads, sign up for the fucking website. <laughs> <laughs> we just tried to make something better, okay? No, we also, yeah, I mean, I got dunked on pretty hard about, last week about just talking about celebrities. <clears throat> oh, did you? Like, Cody's so fucking LA now, dude. Yeah. Talking about celebrities and he's just hanging out with You can't tell me if you were in a room with Leonardo DiCaprio. You cannot tell me that you wouldn't be shitting your pants. You would be. I've been in the room with him. No, when? When John why did you talk about it? As I told you when I joked about him being a baseball player. So we were technically in the same room. Oh yeah, true. Were you shitting your pants at all? No. See, I think you're lying. I wasn't. I just turned back and he's like, uh, he's famous. It's the wolf of fucking Wall Street. Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. <laughs> you Them... turn around and he's like going. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> no, I turn around and I'm like, yo, that's the guy that hid inside the bear. <laughs> <laughs> that's the motherfucking Revenant right that's there. It's the Revenant guy. <laughs> oh, I was going to make a mean ass <laughs> joke. You know, you know who should have been smacked was Leo when he was getting up there talking about that dumb global warming shit when he yeah. finally got his damn uh, whatever the fuck award that was. Yeah. That golden. Green peace, whatever the fuck. That golden Rolls Royce symbol that he received. Mm -hmm. Someone should have ran up and smacked him. That global warming shit is lame, bro. And it's fake. <laughs> <laughs> so speaking of small towns. I was in Indianapolis this weekend. When were we speaking of small towns? Well, we were talking like, you know, we were talking like some country bumpkins. Oh, yeah. Country. I guess we were. I'll use the southern accent when I like go on stage in the Midwest, and then people will be like, we don't sound like that. And I'm like, yeah, it's fine. We don't sound like that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> we don't. We don't. Hey, we don't sound like that. <laughs> That's that was more English. I got English at then. So I was in Indianapolis. First of all, what an infinitely better city than Oklahoma City. Okay. Let me just say that right there. I don't know if our executive any, producer, any Ryan... Objections? Do we have any objections to that? ...is listening? <laughs> he just I don't screamed think, from the engine room. Yeah, I don't think anybody he heard screamed. that. screamed. <laughs> Objection! I don't know if anyone heard that, but oh my God. I have to control my laughter so I don't pass out. Oh my god, dude, that was <laughs> that was straight out of a cartoon, bro. <laughs> <It> really was. <laughs> well, while he's locked away in that room, he can go crazy to this. Ryan, if Oklahoma City is worse than Indiana, say nothing right now. Yep, we got him. We he got agrees. Him. Yeah, he so agrees. We you know, Indianapolis. Indianapolis, that's what I meant. What a far better city than Oklahoma City. And why is that? It was just better. So would you say the people that come from that city are generally better? Yeah. Okay. And the people that come from Oklahoma City generally. Yeah. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Uh -oh. Yeah. <laughs> He's on set. Uh, what? He's on set. He's on what? set. What? The boss say is it. here. Say it. I'm say sorry. Say it. We're kidding. We're kidding. We're kidding. <laughs> He comes in here and beats the shit out of yeah. you. He did what Jake What if Paul he came up and just slapped <laughs> yeah. him in the face <laughs> yeah. and left? <laughs> My executive producer just slapped the shit out of me. <laughs> wow. Okay. Wow. Wow. Okay. Wow. <laughs> no, he's in the corner. Look. Now, are you just going to stand there for a while? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Listen, I, it's a better city because. Uh, oh, actually, no, I'll give you this. I think Oklahoma City has better food. But Indianapolis was a better vibe. Okay. It was a better vibe. And that is undeniable. I'll take that. Yeah, yeah. You have to agree because Indianapolis does not have a plethora of crack dens. Surra yeah, yeah. Now, now you're leaving. Now you're leaving. <laughs> yeah, like, they got me there. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, this is a part of the argument you won't win. Um, no, but they have better crack dens. In Indianapolis? That's the, yeah, no, I'm saying in Oklahoma City. That's the way you have to position it. That's true. They would be. Actually, like, well, we have really good crack dens. Yeah, I don't know if they'd be better, honestly. Okay. Hey guys, we want to take a quick break to thank the sponsor of today's episode, DoorDash. You want Chinese, they want pizza, and someone is craving froyo. There's something for everyone though on DoorDash. Mm -hmm. 
DoorDash connects you with restaurants you love right now and right to your door. And now, you can get grocery store <laughs> essentials you need with DoorDash too. Get drinks, snacks, and other household items delivered in un- under an hour. Because <laughs> that's what family does. <laughs> Ordering is easy. Open the DoorDash app, choose what you want from where you want, and your items will be left safely outside your door with the contactless delivery drop-off setting. Just to give some context, he's doing Vin Diesel's voice. I'm not doing Vin Diesel. So that's a joke from the bonus episode. I am Vin Diesel. (laughs) Okay, he's Vin Diesel. I am Vin Diesel. And he's endorsing DoorDash. I am Vin Diesel endorsing DoorDash. (laughs) With over 300,000 partners in the U.S., Puerto Rico, Canada, and Australia, you can support your neighborhood go-tos or choose from your favorite national restaurants like Popeye's, Chipotle, and Cheesecake Factory, which I know Vin Diesel loves. Yes, I do. (laughs) And for a limited time, the listeners of this podcast can get 25% off with zero delivery fees on their first order of $15 or more when you download the DoorDash app and enter the code TIMELY. That's I wasn't going to do it. But it's tiny. It's tiny. It's the tiny. code is tiny. <laughs> That's 25% off up to a $10 value and zero delivery fees on your first order when you order when you download the DoorDash app in the App Store and enter the code tiny. We do that for you because you're family. <laughs> Again, don't forget that's code tiny for 25% off your first order with DoorDash. Subject to change, terms apply. But no, so uh, the real highlight of the weekend was I go into this bar across the street from the venue because that's the that's the one drawback to Indianapolis. There's maybe like three things to eat after nine o'clock. Mm-hmm. Steak and shake. And they got these two bars and one of them is called Kilroy's. And we go into Kilroy's. Is that famous? Kilroy's? Heard that, yeah, it might I've be a chain. I don't know. Okay. Uh, you heard of D's? D's. Is that a restaurant? No, Deezer. It's a music app. Oh, it's a music streaming service. Yeah. Oh, yeah. I've heard of that before. Which you can listen to uh, our music on. Yeah. Yeah. Can. Swipe up now. No. Uh, okay. I'm sitting in the Kilroy's, and music's playing, and then out of nowhere, I start to hear a, a really familiar song, and it's fucking Walkman. What? No way. And I'm sitting, and... The Walkman starts playing, and there's like this table of moms. They just start turning the fuck up. And and and, and by the way, by the way, by the way, this is uh, on this night. It just so happened that Bieber was in town. Okay. Um. So there were a lot of there were a lot of believers in the in the restaurant. Okay. You know, and uh, shout out to everyone who came to the show. Still sold out, even though Belieber was across the street. Let's so fucking go. Let's go. So. It's all these moms in like Bieber gear and they're getting hype. And I'm looking around, I'm like, what the fuck is going on? And so I think maybe someone works there and they're just being funny and they, like put they saw on. you and they turned it on. Yeah. And then maybe like, like some like waiter might walk by and be like, oh, I was just fucking with you, man. Like, yeah. whatever. So I like kind of like look around and I'm just seeing a bunch of drunk people start like dancing to the song. <laughs> Let's go. And the moms next to us are like, you know, they're they're hype. They're moving. And then Tom is laughing and he's filming them and he's recording me and he's filming them and he's recording me. And I'm like uncomfortable. And I'm just laughing like they have no idea this is literally me, dude. <laughs> they have no fucking clue. Just turn. Excuse me. Are you aware of who does who does this song? <laughs> me. You're looking at him right here. Yeah. So yeah. Dude, were they like were they singing it? No, they didn't really know the song. They didn't know the song. It just <clears throat> came on yeah. on Deezer. Yeah. Cuz that's probably what they were using to stream it. 100%. In the restaurant. Yep. And these moms just were turning up. Yeah. That was the whole goal. We're making the song. We're like this one's for the milfs. Yeah. And I and I knew This it, one's for the Bieber moms. Yeah. I knew it wasn't anyone fucking with me for sure at the end of the song because it was just a playlist. So the song just like finished and faded out and then another one came on. It was like the weekend. Fuck. So someone put a playlist that together. I party with him last, last weekend. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> nice. Hey. Hey. hey, hey, hey. Nice. Yep. <clears throat> the party you weren't allowed at? <laughs> yeah, exactly. The party I snuck into. <laughs> so LA now, dude. Sneaking into parties. <laughs> Ultimate stand behavior. <laughs> You snuck in. 
Dude, imagine you ran up to the weekend. You're like, dude, I have made so many fan cams of you, and to meet you in <laughs> yeah, person yeah, yeah. is just like surreal. Bro. I run weekend memes on <clears throat> yeah. Twitter. I don't know if you've seen it. That's me, dude. Yeah, that's me. We should we should get a selfie real quick. Nah, and th- that was the weirdest thing ever. Just... That's so. I would have been so stoked. Yeah, I want that to happen one time. It was weird. That's like a pipe dream for me. Just, just the... being out in the wild and. And hearing catching, your own music and just oh, seeing sorry. people organically sort of like be like, oh, this is a good, this is a good one. Yeah, yeah. No, we were killing it in Indianapolis, man. Better than Oklahoma City. Yeah, that's true. That is true. Yeah, that's true. That so that was just fucking weird. And um, trying to you have the video. I don't. I should have asked for it. I want to see that? I took a selfie video of myself, just like kind of shaking my head, but I don't think you can really hear it. And uh, it was funny to just like come off of that, and then the waiter to just slam three tacos on the table. <laughs> Immediately after, was like boom, because the uh, the waiters in that place hate you, okay, for just being alive, right? And I th- that's generally no bartenders for the most part mm. hate you. Yeah, they well, hate you. It depends if they work in a place where they get like dope tips. I feel like they are they tend to be no. You don't think no? Every bartender. Hates you. I don't think you can generalize every bartender. I'm, I'm sure there's a select few that are nice. I have never met any of them before. Because you're LA. Because you're cause, LA. Yeah, that's what it they is. Can, they can smell They look at me, they're like, this budding actor, so fucking, yeah, clout chaser probably. Yeah. Probably brags about being at parties they're with like, celebs. Oh yeah, this is gay guy number three from Game of Thrones. Yeah, exactly. This fucking, fucking guy. Yeah. What do you want, dude? Yeah, I know who you are, man. Oh, gay guy number three. Yeah, you yeah, fucking yeah, think you're yeah. a big shot cool. in here. Yeah. What do you want? What'll it be? Aperol split? Of course. <laughs> Aperol spritz, of course. Aperol split? Yeah. No, that's that's what you <laughs> that's, do that's after ice you drink cream. <laughs> that's what you do. <laughs> Dude, the Aperol split? Yeah. <laughs> nice. Uh, yeah, no, no, bartenders are assholes generally. But like, I'm not saying that's bad. I'm saying like they kind of deserve to be. They just have been through shit. Yeah. It's just drunk people all the time. The one time, like in December, I was like staying sober for a while and I um, went to a bar and I was just like, I I was just perplexed by how annoying everyone was. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. It's crazy, you know? I mean, it's like like midnight on a Saturday, right? It's like peak drunk hours. Yeah. And people just smell like shit. Yeah. Everyone's just like, kind of like puffy and... And they're all just being annoying, you know. Yeah. And I'm just sitting there like, God damn, how can you, how do you do this? Yeah, no, that that I can relate to. I mean, this so place, then to serve those people, yeah, saying is you know, the the people at Kilroy's, um, uh, this that's no shade to them. Uh, they are the employees of that restaurant are broken people. I've not seen spirits so low on humans in a long time. Right. There's a dude busting a table, and. Uh, I come up to him like, "Hey, man, is it bussing?" No, I'm kidding. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> Could you imagine? Did you actually? Oh my <laughs> no, god! No, no. Yo, dude, is it bussing? Oh, Anyways, bro, uh, I want this. No, <laughs> no. I come up to him. I go, "Hey, man, is it uh, like self seating?" He's just wiping the table and just into his own armpit, like not even over his shoulder to me. He goes, "Yep." <laughs> I'm like, "For sure, man. Rough night. Gotcha." <laughs> what if he's like? I don't fucking care anymore. No, that is basically what he should have said. Sure, see yourself or I can show. I don't care. Yeah. None of this matters. Yeah. What are we? What are we? What is the point of What anything? is the point? Yeah. So then I Why go- did I get out of bed today? <laughs> dude, the funniest like, part. Damn. <laughs> dude. Is it busting though? <laughs> <laughs> hey man, is it self-seating? I've been here way too long. <laughs> show i got the cheese curds yeah is that a yes yeah (laughs) no dude the funniest shit was so you know the the a lot of the wait staff was women and i'm sure they deal with bullshit all night so my fucking opener zayed he (laughs) he goes up to one of them he's like oh excuse me he's just like a nice guy the woman just turns and walks away he's like no for sure yeah definitely (laughs) okay then another waitress walks by 
And he goes like, do, do you know? If, uh, and just do be good. Okay, can we get? He turns to me and he's like, uh, he's like, uh, do you notice women just don't respect me? <laughs> like, it's just, it's so fucking funny. I was crying, dude. And then we sat down. None of them bust our table. And then Zayed's like. I'll, I'll I'll clean the table, <laughs> and he gets up and he goes to like the wait staff little booth, like where they ring people out and like assign tables. He just grabs a rag and a bottle, like a squirt bottle, and he just <laughs> and wipes the table down and puts the shit back. I was crying. I'm like, dude, it's so cool you clocked in today. He's like, yeah, no, yeah, definitely, because we're not gonna get service. He actually did that. Yeah, he did it. Like to be a dick or no, like he just. Like your table needed to get bossed. Yeah, and he just knew. He just knew if the if the wait staff kept looking at him, they would just not. <laughs> as long as he was at the table, they weren't gonna wipe the table down. <laughs> I feel like if they would have seen him do that, though, they would have gotten majorly insulted. No, no? I don't think they would have. They, they just they don't even a care at all. Single fuck. Right. Then the waitress that night, because we went there, because you know you got to go there two nights in a row. Yeah, yeah, I have to. When they treat you like shit one night. It's like gotta go well, back. It's famous Kilroy's. Yeah. yeah. Uh, we go back the second night, and that's when you know that whole thing happened. And the bust wait- my fucking table! I'm the one in this. Yeah, song. yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> that's what I should have said. Yeah, and they would have swiftly like put a pizza on a spinning disc with blades and just threw it at my neck. Yeah, uh, we we sit down, and he busts the table. Whatever. The waitress brings me a menu, and I turn it over. I was like, "Oh, uh, is the kitchen still doing tacos?" She just grabs it flips it back over and she's like you're on the late night menu now <laughs> i was like well that's a weird way of saying it and then she goes mm-hmm i was like whoa all right i'll, I'll get a pepperoni pizza she goes okay and then just walks away like it was just <laughs> but it was like they're past the point it wasn't only pepperonis on that pizza yeah it was definitely shit I hate to tell you yeah shit pee he was a lot of human fluids mm-hmm too. But it, I <laughs> pee. Yeah. You get a piece that's just soaked in piss. Yeah. Like it's not even like you didn't even try to hide it. Yeah. It's just piss dripping. It's like a you know, Prince Street pizza, how the pepperonis <laughs> collect the grease. It's just piss. <laughs> it's just that just piss. Yeah. All the- <laughs> on that little trough on the edge of the pizza rim. Yeah, it's just piss. It's clearly piss. It stinks like piss. Yeah. It's like, no, it's no, it's not. Pizza's fine. No, I would have been like, did you pee on this? They'd have been like, mm-hmm. And mm-hmm. they just would have kept walking. That's the late night menu. <laughs> You're on the late night You're menu now. on the late now. night menu. <laughs> yeah, and and I, again, this is no shade to them. The Because if you look one table over, the people they deal with, there was like a table of, I don't know what the fuck they were. I don't even know how to describe They were meatheads Damn. for sure. Okay. No, but I- don't I, know where you are going to go with that. Uh, I don't know what the fuck race they were. No, <laughs> no, nah, nah, they were- I mean, these dudes were just like, you know, uh, mutant steroid people. Yeah. Uh, way too excited about innocuous stuff. Their whole conversation was just slamming the table. Like, couldn't go maybe a couple minutes without fucking boom. Yes, bro. Yes. I couldn't imagine having to go up to that every 10 minutes being like, you guys want something else? Yeah. So, yeah, I, I get it. I get why their spirits were so broken. Uh, that place would be depressing to me, too. The happiest person was the security guard. <laughs> we he pl- gets to throw people out, probably. Yeah, and we were playing, uh, we were playing like a Pacers themed like arcade basketball game, uh, and we were playing. And he walks by, and then I was like, "Hey, man, what's the record for this?" He's like, uh, three seventeen. He's like, uh, "I did that. We got it on camera." I was like, "What? Get the fuck out of here!" So we put a dollar in. I was like, "I'm like, smoke this thing. I got to see it." This dude just draining him. Yeah. He's just like he's putting them, Basically. reaching over and no, dude, it it just looked like a perfect circle. Yeah, you know. And then that's sick. And what was funny was he was like smiling ear to ear, and this is how I know he has coworker envy because some waitress like looks at him and she looks at another one and she goes or she looks at him and she looks at another waitress and says he does this every fucking night. <laughs> and goes back to like <laughs> shuffling her receipts. I'm like, oh, maybe you should do security then. <laughs> yeah. You know? Jeez, yeah, because that's all it takes. Yeah, is willpower. Yeah, to work security. That's all. You just have to want to do it. You just have to believe. That's it. Yeah, yeah. Believe you can do it. I tell you about the time I was at a bar like a couple months ago. No, and uh, I left my card there. No, like a couple nights before, and so I come back. I'm like, hey, man, I left 
left my card here and he was like okay wh- what's the name and i give him the name and he's like okay and he goes to like the drawer of cards and he's just like fl- flipping through them trying to find my name and he like gets to the back and he's like <sighs> closes the drawer goes to the other side of the bar opens another drawer flips through all of them some reason doesn't find my card so he comes over and he's like not here dude not here and i was like okay well can i get a drink then he's like <sighs> Yeah, what do you want? And I was like, I'll just get a beer. And he was like, okay. And I give him my new card, and he goes, don't forget it this time. Oh. <laughs> and walks away. Oh. <laughs> it's like, damn, dude. <laughs> Sick. Yeah. I got I got a, taught a lesson. Yeah, maybe that guy, that guy should. And you know what's funny? Yeah. I forgot it. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I did. <laughs> the next morning, I woke up. I was like, fuck. Never going back there. No, you got to go back the next day. Hey, man. Hey, man. I forgot I left it. my card here again. <laughs> I left my card here again. Why don't you go look for it? What drawer is it? Yeah. I think it's in the far one. Then you just huck one in you the corner. You can't cor- find it? Here. <laughs> you huck one Here's in the, the corner one. on the ground? Yeah. Oh, it's that one over there. Oh, it's that one. Then you should bend over and I'll grab get, it for me. I'll get four mojitos. <laughs> <laughs> the hardest drink to make. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> then you sip one. I don't and like you, it. You have you, all you have is like a pocket full of like a hundred prepaid debit cards. Yeah, have like nine bucks on them. Yeah. and every day you forget your card yeah. there. Why don't you go fetch my card? I forgot it here yesterday. Again? Oh, oh, I'm such a klutz. <laughs> oh, look at that. I have another one. Let's hope I don't forget this one either. I'll get sixty-five old fashions, please. One for everyone in the bar. Thank you so much. <clears throat> Sip one. This doesn't taste very good. <laughs> you should make these again for the whole room. I could have sworn I said mezcal. Did I not? That's Oops. what I meant. <laughs> I'll do some more. Another round, please. Oops, I dropped my card on your side of the bar. You wouldn't mind grabbing that for me, would you? <laughs> Oops, I threw it over the well. <laughs> the well <laughs> you know that shit like that trough yeah, you reach yeah, into yeah, yeah I think when they get the most annoyed is when you order like three of a drink and then someone walks up behind you and goes can I get one of those two and they're like oh can we actually make it one more but they're like just finishing yeah like they made just enough for three and now they gotta make a whole new batch and they're like, <laughs> That's when they're like yep just, just keep doing that yeah oh sorry just one more yeah you want a good tip right yeah you do this oh, one, right? I'm sorry, I forgot. My other buddy wants one, too. You make one more. Oh, you know, he actually left his card here last week as well. You mind, you mind, mind taking a look? Yeah, that's... um. It was the best because we were walking out the second night. And uh, someone goes, hey, uh, are you? No, I'm like, yeah, what's up? Take a quick picture. They walk away. And this waitress goes, are you a SoundCloud rapper or something? And I laughed. I'm like, is that that common in Indianapolis? That a SoundCloud rapper just walks into Kilroy's and it just goes up? <laughs> Yo, this is fucking... I was just like, what a what an assumption. And she just... It, it wasn't even wasn't even a question. It wasn't like... Couldn't be anything else. It was like, you're definitely a SoundCloud rapper. Yeah. So we told her, yeah. Yeah, yeah, you should have. Yeah, some, some waiter in Palm Springs was like, Yo, are you famous? And I was like... I mean, I was at a party with the weekend. Yeah, <laughs> like yeah. literally last weekend. So and Leonardo, DiCaprio. you tell me. Yeah, Tiger was there. I don't know if you've ever heard of him before. Yeah, he was I held super his drunk. Hair. I won't. I won't get into it. He was really drunk, but I it's held like, his hair when he threw up. Yeah, we're just like you. We get drunk too. <laughs> Celebs, you know. And so, what else was I going to say? Oh, I went into this fucking store. No, would you tell him when he was like, "Are you famous?" Were you like, "Fuck yeah"? No, I think I just said no, and he was like, "Oh." Oh, I could have sworn. Ah, oh, maybe not. And he like walked away. <laughs> but I mean, like that that's like the, I, I, there's no good way to answer that question. Like they don't, I know they're not meaning it, but that's like the biggest dick <clears throat> question. To yeah. Have, like to make someone brag about themselves. Yeah. You're famous, right? Yeah. I say, yes. say yes to that. It's just like, yeah, yeah. Like that's so arrogant. No, you got to say it really fast. Yeah. Are you famous? Yep. Yep. A-list. Yep. Yeah. What do you know me from? Looks like you're stupid. <laughs> yeah. my, fa- my favorite thing now is when uh, someone goes, can I get a picture? And I say, no. 
Mm. And I do it with a smile. And I hold it for a good three, four seconds. And watching them just like, like they want to, <laughs> they want to push back, but they don't know what to do. <laughs> I've done it a few times. Girls, you say no and you just stand there? Yeah, some girl's like, can I get a picture? And I go, no. Nah. <laughs> ah, I'm kidding. And then I like, <laughs> it's just the funniest three seconds. <laughs> It'd be so funny because normally you'd say that and then walk away. Yeah. So to stay there, say that and just stand there. You just like, hang. Nah. <laughs> and they're like, oh. oh. Can, can we talk? No. No. <laughs> can we... What is this one? <laughs> so what are we doing then? It's just a vibe. Just a vibe. Yeah, we're vibing. <laughs> I just... <laughs> one girl was like, uh, okay. Like, when I said no, she was just like, all right. I felt so bad. It's, it's, it's fun, though. You know? That's what, you know, that's, that's what you got to do. When people acknowledge you in the street... You shit on them. Yeah, 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 yeah. That's that's the way to do it. Yeah, make them feel really bad. Fuck you. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I'll just go fully psychotic. No, no. What are you gonna do? You're gonna capture me and then send this picture to the government, motherfucker? <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. You think I'm fucking stupid? I know who you work for. I know who the fuck you've been following me all day. That's what the fuck you've been doing. You've been following me all day since the airport. I saw you. Like. Okay, never mind. Yeah, it is never mind. My mind. <laughs> I'm protecting it. <laughs> and then just turn back to my meal and then scream at it. <laughs> <laughs> ah! <laughs> like, we gotta go, we gotta go. Yeah, sit down and just go back to eating. That's funny. Yeah. That's really funny. <laughs> Screaming at your meal. <laughs> I don't know. Can you get a picture? <laughs> <laughs> oh shit! Ew. <laughs> no, it is. I'm just saying, being like creepy and yeah. crazy. I don't. Can I get a picture? You? I don't know. Can you? What is a picture? What is a picture? <laughs> <laughs> Damn. So, um, have you been watching the fucking Johnny Depp and Amber Heard thing? <laughs> the most I've tapped into is a series of dad jokes on Reddit. That should not be funny. I mean, the obvious is Amber Turd. Yeah, I love that one. Yeah, it's not a dad joke. Yes, it is. That's no, it's not. Yes, it is. No, it's not. That's good old fashioned. Just a good joke. It's hum humor. That's good old fashioned humor. Humor. Yeah, there was another one that. So I was reading about how she left the piece of shit on his bed, mm -hmm. <laughs> and I, I man, one of the comments was a. Uh, uh, he's had enough of her shit already, and I don't know why that just, <laughs> just killed me. Yeah. And then someone said, uh, hashtag me poo. And that's not, <laughs> that shouldn't, yeah, it shouldn't, it shouldn't, it shouldn't, it shouldn't, it shouldn't, <laughs> it shouldn't. Oh, I'm shaking my damn head at yeah, that. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> it's so dumb. But fucking A. God damn it. That shit cracked me up. Yeah, it killed me. Shouldn't have. <laughs> It should not be funny. <laughs> me poo. It's not funny. It's not funny. <laughs> it's not funny. Why does it work? Uh, <laughs> it's not funny. <laughs> me poo. Yeah, it is kind of funny that like, I don't know. It's like a relatively complex case. I mean, there's just like l layers to it, right? And like, yeah. like devastation on both sides like he like lost his career and she i guess is lying i don't i don't really know right but she, the whole she, thing that anyone yeah. can focus on is the fact that she's shit in his fucking bed yeah yeah she lost a turd <laughs> burger dude yeah seriously oh man i gotta find there was a fourth one and again it's not it's not it's not it shouldn't be amber funny. turd amber turd it should not be funny dude it should not be funny <laughs> oh hold on hold on let me find it i got it I really, I was like captivated by this fucking. Why? What aspect? I, I just, I don't know. Like seeing him on the stand, just do anything. Yeah, is cool. Do you know what I'm saying? Oh. And he could be in. I don't know. I don't know who's gonna win this. You know, that's up to the jury. Mm -hmm. Right now, it looks like she's like fucking lying for sure. Yeah. But uh, you know, I'm just watching him. Like he's so like eloquent, but not really. Mm. 
Just he's like an, art, an artist. You can just tell. You know? This is that voice. I watched him for like an hour before they even turned the sound on on the broadcast. Before they even they even started the the courtroom, it was just him sitting there on the stand for an hour. And you were tapped in. I tapped in. I had so it up you'll my watch second that, monitor. But you won't watch Batman. I meant to tell you. Oh. I watched about a quarter of it last night. All right, we're gonna get into it. 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 Wait, just real quick. Hashtag me poo. It was definitely a movement. Uh, <laughs> that's not that's not it's, good. It's not bad follow up. Me poo is funny, but Yeah. It's definitely a movement. Anyway, so you watched an hour of him silent. And then what? That's it. I'm just saying, like, I like even I don't know, like, I watched a lot of the shit that he was actually saying, mm -hmm. and then I don't know. I just like yesterday I saw it. It started because it's like on every day. Yeah, it's right now too. It's on every day, all day. <laughs> Why do they broadcast these things? I mean, it's him. But I'm saying, did like, yeah, I don't know. I just feel like it's such a high profile case. They're like this dude has it, not like. Don't you think all the social media and everything could sway the? jurors i mean his you know his agent probably worked it out i mean he hasn't done a movie in a while so yeah. this would probably be good to, yeah and it you know. i think it will be oh yeah i think this motherfucker's gonna get cast in everything after this i think he's gonna get casted in the remake of the whole of the of the yeah. story yeah. yeah you get to play himself and he plays amber heard yeah yeah <laughs> damn damn what yeah you know shitting in what was supposed to be my own bed was a traumatic scene for me but Going through the other side, I think it was cathartic. <laughs> I mean, nah, dude, that I, I, I don't even know what's going. I I just know that she's a bad person and she's hit him a few times. Yeah, but that's all I know. That's what it sounds like. I read something about how the whole compilation of the lawyer being like hearsay, hearsay is pretty common. Ah, uh, yeah, he also objected to his own question, which was pretty fucking awesome. Yeah, legendary. Yeah, he like, asked the question, and then the judge says something and he goes objection and she's like you asked the question yeah. and he's like oh right right sorry <laughs> my man yeah. I mean that's you know he's sick of the bullshit yeah exactly that's what he's had to do <laughs> do all case you know yeah, hey yeah. hearsay man it's hearsay yeah yeah that's the same thing that you gotta do he's just playing mind games mm -hmm. which is the same thing you gotta do when someone asks you for a picture yeah can I get a picture can I get a picture what objection <laughs> Object, objection hearsay objection hearsay can I get a picture objection a hearsay picture? let me get a picture but I asked for the picture objection I want a picture now can of I get me. the picture can I take a selfie <laughs> can I take a selfie of me can I take a picture of you on your phone <laughs> <laughs> they're like sure you look great and you can tell everyone I took that <laughs> can you get a picture of me on my phone Okay. I won't tell anyone. I won't tell this. anyone you took this. I'm going to tell people I took this. I took this. <laughs> it was a selfie. That's what I'm going to tell people. <laughs> and they'll never know. But nah, they, uh, uh, yeah, so I don't, I don't want to be glib if she's like a bad person, but it's, it's definitely, um, it's really cool that Johnny's back on TV. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> It worked for me, dude. I'm telling you. I'm sitting there like, God, everything this guy says. It's like, you can tell why he's such a revered actor. Because he's just good at talking? He's just good at talking. Yeah. <clears throat> Which, I don't know. Though. I feel like that also kind of like sways the, like it just makes it easier for you to believe him, you know? Yeah. Because that's his fucking career. Yeah. Yeah. But do we have any, do you have any clips? <laughs> a few things about uh, Coachella and and the fe fecal uh, delivery <laughs> um, and say, saying that it was the dogs and I, I could I'm sorry I could not agree with her I'd lived with those dogs I picked up their fun it was not the dogs <laughs> <laughs> their fun it's the it's the words he chooses. Uh, exactly, right? Yeah. He he doesn't say like a, he doesn't speak like a regular person. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. I've picked and those his, shits and up. every text he sends is just fucking absurd. Yeah. Filled with exclamation marks and he's like I don't know, talking to his assistant or whatever and he's like, "Brett, my darling." 
You're like, God damn, this guy's cool. Yeah. So it's really cool that, uh, you know, everyone's pointing out that <laughs> they're just sexualizing the shit out of him while he's on trial for abuse. Yeah. No, he's on trial. No, this isn't for abuse. This is defamation. Oh, she's suing him? He's suing her. He's suing her. Yes. Got it. See, I don't even know. Because he's like, it's not true what you said about me. Oh. And what did he, you she, say? She accused him of, of abuse. Okay. So he lost Captain Jack Sparrow. He lost all of his movie roles. I career see. basically hit the shitter. Yeah. And he was like, it's not true. Basically, what happened was you took a whole bunch of videos of me in order to make this case mm. and make it seem like I was abusing you when really you were abusing me the whole time. Mm. And I lost my career because of it. Wow. I think that's what, right? That's the gist? Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, she's also countersuing him for a hundred million dollars. Countersuing for what? The same thing of defamation, just kind of going back and forth with it. He defecation. <laughs> nice, dude. That's that cool. good. <laughs> that was good. Just clear clap on that one. No, so, no smack back. <clears throat> defecation. Yeah. Yeah. So, what is this? Slay me, Johnny. What is that? Did I read that right? You did. And then she writes, my throat is yours. You're going to be the death of me, but I don't care. And then you write, I have other uses for your throat, which do not include injury. I have other uses for your throat, which do not include injury. Sorry, could you read that again? <laughs> to your words, sir, right? Mm -hmm. I read that right, correct? You did. Yes. You can take that down. Yeah, you know, he was like, could you read that again? My DMs are going to be on fire. <laughs> and I just need you to highlight that one more time. I'm surprised you didn't make eye contact with the camera know, when they right? said that shit. <laughs> could you read that again? I have other uses for your throat. And you just fucking. That's right. Oh, I did say that. <laughs> Dude, wait. Just repeat his sentence. <laughs> Just pretend you're the guy reading this shit. And then you said, I have other uses for your throat. <laughs> I'm sorry, could you read that again? Could you read that again? Sure. And then you said, I have other uses for your throat. <laughs> just, fucking, just going in yeah. uh, <laughs> the judge is like uh, <laughs> recess <laughs> recess Jesus Christ <laughs> all the TikTok clips yeah <laughs> naughty Johnny yeah <laughs> Johnny like that's what this one is look at naughty Johnny that's what the, this is literally a fucking courtroom it's a yeah. courtroom. What are you doing? Yeah. Naughty Johnny. Yeah, but it's Johnny it's, being naughty. It's Johnny Depp. So bro. fucking hot, slay me, Johnny. <laughs> that's how that's crazy. That's he sued for a hundred million dollars. <laughs> no, that that's how much sex appeal this dude has. Is he could be in literally the driest environment. Yeah. He's got that shit. Yeah. Wet. Yeah. Gushing. Dude. So fucking hot to get sued. <laughs> when Johnny Depp says, I have other uses for your throat that do not include injury. What is this? What is this? When Johnny uh, pause it, pause it. Music, music. Maybe just play it silently. Yeah. Which is a shame because I love that voice. And Johnny says. It's just, it's just a bunch of. I volunteer as uh, tribute. Uh, volunteer as tribute. Nice. Nice, dude. Nice. A Hunger Games <laughs> reference. Sick. Nice job, whatever millennial wrote that shit. <laughs> yeah, seriously. Good meme, dude. Bring up his emails and texts real quick. Oh, oh are these like the violent ones? Uh, never well, mind. it's not fun anymore now, is it? He did say some crazy shit. Do you know any of it off the top of your head? I mean, like, he wrote to his friend and was like, I don't know, like, basically, like, called her a cunt, hope <laughs> that she, like, wakes up in a ditch or something like that. Mm. Something I'm paraphrasing, but... Uh, objection, hearsay. <laughs> hearsay? Let's drown her before we burn her. Whoa. <clears throat> yeah. I no, would fuck he her burnt corpse afterwards to make sure she's dead. No, he's just preparing for his role as the villain in Joan of Arc. That's all. Right, yeah. right. This method. Yeah. Okay, so the Batman.
Oh, yeah. Speaking of. I think it's. Say it. Say it. No, no, no. I'm not exaggerating. Say it. I think it's the best movie I've ever seen. So good you stopped it. <laughs> it was so good. I had to stop it after a quarter of the movie. Because it was so, so good. That I did, so I could sleep. God forbid you watch any more of it. Exactly. You may have no reason to live. I wanted to savor it. Yeah. Because if I had finished it, something that, that's that good, knowing in my mind that that I couldn't experience that again for the first time yeah. would be enough for me to cease existing. Actually, like that. that's why everyone at Kilroy's is sad because they've seen the Batman and now they have no reason to live anymore. Yeah. yeah. No, I, I was actually really, I mean, we've, we don't have to do this because <laughs> we've done this so much. But now that I've seen it, mm-hmm. some of it, I was really surprised by actually how bad it was. <laughs> I'm not kidding, dude. Yeah. I'm not kidding. Yes. Embrace. I kept waiting for it to like get good, and I'm Embrace like, this Embrace the sucks. mid. Sucks. Yeah. Dude, that fucking scene, the very first scene where you see him without his mask on, mm-hmm. and he's got the emo ass music, <laughs> and the guy, and the, <laughs> yeah, and the guy, the guy comes in, he's like, you gotta stop doing this. He's like, you're not my dad. Yep. I said, what the fuck? That shit is Angsty lame. Angsty teen? Yeah. It's lame. Get out of here. <laughs> You're not my dad. Get out of my room. Get out of my room. I want to be the Batman. Uh, uh, uh. Yeah. Yeah. But I, I do like the Riddler so far. Yeah. And I like his riddles. <laughs> Lie still. Yeah. 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 Bars. Okay. Bars. Yeah. Wait till Buddy gets gimpy. Yeah. Don't you love like how he's just like his tongue is fighting through that hole? Yeah. Hello, Batman. <laughs> He's eating that shit yeah. out, dude. Yeah. That's what, hello, Batman. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> it's not. It's a rat maze. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah. He does. He never actually says that. He says it's a maze. Yeah. Yeah. Same shit. Yeah. Same shit. I was. I was waiting for rat maze. No, I'm sorry. I misquoted. It's a maze. What is that? Yeah. It's gay porn. <laughs> oh. What makes it gay porn? <laughs> it's when two men have sex with each other. Oh. Or perhaps two women. <laughs> oh. Why is it on your computer? Because I think I might be gay. Hey. Then he just walks out. Yeah. <laughs> I am gay. <laughs> <laughs> I am gay. <laughs> I am gay. <laughs> He's just finding random men in the gay district of yeah. Gotham City hooking up. <laughs> and then he rips one off another dude. He's like, what are you doing? I'm gay. <laughs> Steals the guy's boyfriend. He's like, what the fuck? What the fuck? <laughs> I'm gay too. No, I am gay. I am gay. <laughs> I am what is gay. I am the one who gays. Then, yeah. Just making out violently <laughs> with some dude's boyfriend. Yeah, that's that's all. That would have been a better movie if Batman was just a gay guy in a gimp suit who's like Mister Steal Your Man. Yeah, <laughs> just, just, just turn into a soap opera yeah. and the club that he goes to. Yeah, the Penguins Club. That's yeah, a giant gay club. Yeah, it's a big gay club. Yeah. yeah, yeah. Then he pulls up in his cool ass car. All the gay guys are outside. They're like, oh, it's fucking him again. Yeah. Yeah. And then everyone's on alert because it's like he might steal your dude. Yeah. You just don't know. Yeah. Yeah. Movie over in 30 minutes. <laughs> <laughs> Could have got all the same vibe. And... <laughs> so that's cool, man. Yeah, it was bad. Uh what what bad part movie? But I'm gonna I'm gonna finish it. Yeah. Cause it's not that bad. I would say it's mid. <laughs> yeah. It's mid. It's just it all right. Um <clears throat> so is the penguin that's the next villain? Uh He's in the movie. I know he's in the movie, but the next major villain is, I forget which, you guys said it last time we were talking about this. The next movie. Uh, it's not the Riddler, it's... They think it'll be a character called Hush. Yes. Oh, okay, That's okay, cool. okay. Yeah. Gotcha. Uh, you know what's crazier? You know who plays the Penguin? Who? Fucking Colin Farrell. Oh my God. Yeah. Holy shit, that's yeah. wild. Transformation is nuts. Seriously. <clears throat> Yeah, that's crazy. 
Yeah, dude. Place. Wait, just, just, just witness the uh, the atrocious dialogue they give. Uh, um, Gordon, dude, that's fucking crazy. Sick. They made him look. They made him regular. Yeah. <laughs> they made him regular. You know that guy has like a murder charge. Colin Farrell. Yeah. Really? Mm, something like that. You see the video of the baby. Which one? Oh, him, they, s- him socking out his fucking artist? No, no. Oh, the, the Walmart the, thing? He killed someone in Walmart, yeah. That's been around. Has it? It's been out. Oh, okay. For yeah. how long? Um, I don't know. Huh. It, but that's, uh, people have known about that footage. It oh. just for some reason got like resurfaced. So, but he got like acquitted, right? Mm-hmm. Huh. Yeah. He got, oh. Colin Farrell was arrested for attempting murder when he was a teenager. Yeah. Wow. Interesting. Yeah. Yeah, you know, sometimes this thing about a celebrity, it might get caught up in some shit. <clears throat> yeah. Nice. Nice. Sorry. I'm sorry. That I'm was sorry. good. That was bad. That, that was, was bad. Good. That was, that good. was bad. Uh, well, let's read this TMG Studios review. There's a TMG Studios apparently in Maryland. Oh, yes. Yeah, um, that said. somebody found on Google. Here it is right here. Um, that's us, they're a by commercial the way. That's, printer. No, that's us. That's us. We're in Maryland. That's yes. been the trick the whole time. That's the beam up to the ship. It's in Maryland. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. <laughs> so that's why sometimes... I don't know why like, the fuck we put it there. It's a dumb idea. Dude. Yeah. What were you going to say? That's why sometimes... That's why sometimes we're late. Yeah. You know, that's why I'm always late. Yeah. Because we're taking some shitty flight to Maryland. Mm-hmm. Love my experience here at TMG <laughs> Studios. This is, wait, this is a review that somebody left on Google. Uh, it's clear to me that the workers here love their jobs and know how to create a comfortable environment. One of the workers, not sure what his name was, but I remember his racial ambiguity, is quite large in stature. And I recall him giving me workout advice. Yeah, yeah. What can I say? He told me that he started to eat protein bars with the rappers. Uh, no W. Uh, and that's <laughs> what made the difference. I love that guy. And his buddy, too. I can't forget him. I will. De- I definitely will be back. Imagine the employees of this company being like, what the fuck are they talking about? Who are they talking about? Who are they talking about? Yo, who here told someone to eat the wrapper <laughs> with no W? Five stars, though. <clears throat> Five it's a stars. Print, it's a commercial printer mm-hmm. in Hagerstown. Yeah. Man, I was uh, uh, s- fucking... I went down a rabbit hole of... Indianapolis or Indiana geography. I I can't. What a fucking town this is. So, first of all, I went go karting in a place called Whiteland, but I was laughing at Whiteland. Yeah. And then there's a just down the way. There's a new Whiteland. So then at that show that night, I I talked to some person in the audience. I'm like, "Where are you from?" And he's like, "Oh, I'm from Brownsburg." <laughs> and then I asked his buddy, "Are like, you from Brownsburg too?" And I like. I was debating posting this clip, but he goes, No, I'm from Purplesville. <laughs> bro, he goes, I am, but I actually just moved to Whitestown. And I'm like, okay. And then some, and, I, and I'm like, what the fuck is going on with your estate? And then some kid messages me after the show. He's like, you think that's bad? He sends me a link to a town called Hindustan. Oh, wow. Then I start going around Indiana. And Zach, you have some fucking explaining to do. There's a Russiaville. There's a Mexico. There's a Denver, a <laughs> Peru, a New London, Shanghai. What? Like Shanghai, Indiana. Shanghai, Indiana. Russiaville? Yeah. Yeah. So some of you just fucking around. No, they have the whole US. There's a did I say this? There's a Mexico. Yeah. They 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 put the whole globe in their one area. This, I was just gas city. Is that what that is? Yeah, oh there. yeah, cool. Gas. Dunkirk, Albany, Portland, Vermont, Port. Oh. <laughs> Jeff. <laughs> That's the best one. Jeff. Jeff, Indiana. What's the name of your state? What's the name of your city? Fucking Randolph. <laughs> Stone. That that's not bad. I'm from Jeff. Rural. <laughs> You're a joke. That's a joke. Get in there, rural Indiana. That that's a dumb, I've no, I swear I've heard this before. I'm from rural Indiana. <laughs> no, the town rural. Did you hear what I just said? No, what? I'm from Jeff. 
<laughs> Come on. My, Come on. my Where are you Jeff. from? Where are you from? My town is I'm Jeff. from Jeff. <laughs> my state is Jeff. My place is Jeff. So stupid. Get the fuck out. Is that Kyle? Balls Town? Balls Town. Balls yeah. Town. Yeah, let's go. Let's go. Dude. Kyle. Dude, it's just straight up Kyle, uh, which, you know, it's just below Manchester if you go down. <laughs> it's just below Manchester, bro. Kyle, Indiana, dude. I need the backstory on all these places, man. Friendship. The Philippines. No, I'm kidding. I'm kidding. <laughs> Probably, honestly, yeah. <laughs> oh, whoa, um, a little Saigon. Wow, where are you from? that's that's his correct. Where are you from? Correct. <laughs> no, where are you from? <laughs> correct. Correct. No, I'm asking you a question. Yeah. So you know, I was. Uh... Oh, Balls Town. <clears throat> but you know, there's probably there's probably a lot of. Uh, you know, towns like this. Seymour? You like that one? You like Seymour? Yes. Seymour balls in your mouth? Oh, shit. I thought you going to say Seymour butts. Oh. This is Buddha? I don't think... Is this still Indiana? Kind of west. <laughs> We're just cruising through the we states. Are. Just making fun of... I just... What the fuck? Towns. Like, <clears throat> I need to know how all this was named. Ireland? Is there an wait? Is is that an Oklahoma City in? That's Oakland City. Okay. Yeah, I just I need to know. Now, is this the case? Like with every state? I mean, maybe. You don't think so? If we zoomed into another, I feel, state I feel right like now. other Midwest states. You know, they have like indigenous names for towns. You know. Yeah. yeah. There's probably dumbass cities around, but you know, Indianapolis or Indiana is a special kind of stupid. Brazil. Yeah, Brazil, Indiana. Brazil. Oh, that's what they mean when they Africa? say come to Brazil. Yo, bro. Look at Africa. That's what people mean when they say come to Brazil. They don't actually mean Attica. Oh. They don't actually people don't mean Brazil like the country. They mean Brazil, Indiana. Yeah. <laughs> hey man, come on down to Brazil. <laughs> you live in Brazil? Yeah. Right up, right above. Correct. <laughs> it's right next to Balls Town. <laughs> We're just below Shanghai. Yeah. Yeah. I don't know, man. Come to my name, Jeff. Egypt. <laughs> Sick, dude. Nice. Yeah. Hey, hit it again. No, do it again. Morocco. That. Oh, take me to Beaver City. That's where oh, I want to yeah, be. Yeah, Beaver City. <laughs> Let's go. <laughs> Woo! Okay. Is there just so much land that you can buy a chunk and just call it whatever? Yeah. Booby Town. <laughs> Zach just messaged that the uh, the former like mayor of Fort Wayne, Indiana, is named or was named Harry Balls. Dude, Indiana fucking rules. We need to move there, man. I gotta move there. We need to move there. Yeah, you know what? They got L.A. Summers. Did they? Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Harry Balls. Harry nice. Balls. You know, be a good Harry Balls. You know, be a good meme if we park the ship and. Indiana, and we make Zach move back there. Yeah, and we make we make Ryan move there. <laughs> and then he buys a plot and he calls it Oklahoma City. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Dude, they got everything. They got a Flint, or is that actual Flint? Yeah, that's Flint. Is it? Oh. Crazy man, they got a Hicksville. Come to Jeff. Come to Jeff. Definitely better the fourth time. Come to Jeff. Yeah. Come to Jeff. Come to my name, Jeff. <laughs> Come to Jeff. <laughs> There's a Lisbon. Nice. Oh fuck. You been to Lisbon? Uh oh. Lisbon. Lisbon is. No, I haven't. Liz been choking on these balls lately. <laughs> <laughs> Who's Liz? Who's Liz? I don't know. This, I mean, I'm just like, the the silence that you feel right now is the same silence I felt just going through Google Maps on the plane. They have a fucking Nebraska. I love this place. Oh, we should move here, man. Yeah. 
if if you're from Indiana and you can explain even one of these, I would love to know. Cause the list the is Indian? and you know in Texas there's like a there's like a German town. I think it's it's I don't know what the name of it is. It's like but they speak German down there, I guess. Hmm. It, you know, it's 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 like in um it's like in New Orleans, like how people are French. Mm-hmm. I think it's similar to that. But yeah, man, you know, I just just we had three minutes left. I had to flex my obscure geographic knowledge now. I love that. Yeah. That, that was a lot of fun. What are we talking about in the bonus? In the bonus. The bonus, by the way, which you can get <laughs> at tmgstudios.tv. It's our own site. We have bonus episodes. They're very good episodes. Very good. It's our own site, <laughs> so we can't get kicked off of it. <laughs> we can tell the truth. Love the truth. Oh, well, Elon Musk. Buying Titter. Yeah, we can we can talk about Elon being your new daddy. Mm-hmm. Um, talk about some go karting in Indiana. Ooh, uh, a, a young boy gets his penis removed because it's too big. <laughs> <laughs> and Vin Diesel yeah, replying Vin Di- to a fan. That's gonna be fun. Yeah. Um, oh, and Tom Brady TikToks. Yeah. That's we got to start with that. I'm fucking stoked for that. Yeah, we'll get into it. Oh, and I and I started the John Wayne Gacy documentary. Okay, nice. The craziest part about that, you know, he's pansexual. What? Yeah, we'll talk about it. <laughs> <laughs> TeamGStudios.tv for bonus episodes. Uh, sign up. Join the bonus if you dare. Join join the bonus. They're a good bonus. They're a good bonus. Everyone's saying they're good. And you know what's cool? Just if I can promote the site a little bit more, just give me five more seconds. Five. Okay? Or people three, people who requested it. I want to download two. the audio, so we enabled it, just like that. We're we're talking to the dev team every single day, trying to make this site better for you guys. Everything that you suggest, we send right to them, and they go, "Okay, we're we're prioritizing this right now," yep. and they make it happen. It's fucking amazing. These yep. guys rule, and uh, so that's just a testament to how the site will just get better and better and better. It will. So thank you so much. Love you. Um, and uh, love you. Love you all. See you in the bonus. It's a good bonus. It's gonna be good.